We're making a two liter starter. So two liters of water. You wanna preferably get it all over your hot plate. That's ideal. And then we're gonna do 200 grams of dry malt extract. Oh gosh, I'm making a mess. So what I like to do, turn your heat on and we're gonna just go ahead and stir in our dry malt extract. And then we're just gonna give it the old stir in. Join the party, guys. Okay. All right. That's nice and stirred in. Get, get a nice close up of that. I just did some fine stirring. So you can see there's, uh, it's all incorporated. Don't have to worry about scorching. It's only two liters, so it'll come up to boil pretty quick. You just want a low boil, 10, 15 minutes. Okay, we gotta crank this down. Cover it with some tin foil, keep any nasties out. We're gonna glove up to chill down. Put it in the sink with some cold water, let it chill. The wort is chilled down. We got our washed log yeast. I'm gonna go ahead and decant most of the uh, liquid off the top, leaving the yeast at the bottom behind. And then we're gonna <clears throat> just swirl it up. Basically, we just don't want it sticking to the bottom. Get all that yeast up. So it looks like we got it all off the bottom. It smells good. And then we're simply gonna put it into our flask. I'm gonna add our stir bar. Boom. Now we're just gonna add our yeast slurry here. I sometimes add yeast nutrient. Um, I can't find any right now. I think I might have used it all, so. Then we're just gonna put our tin foil back on. Last things last, we're gonna turn our stir plate on and put on your stir plate for 36 to 48 hours. 